All right, here's our update. That's what I got done yesterday. Got all the way around. So this, pretty damn solid. I got the nail or the screws in to the front, but I have not. I'm out of screws. I gotta go to the store and get some. <laughs> But uh, yeah, I got the boards moved and out in the place so I see exactly how many I'm going to need. And uh, now it's just a matter of screwing them suckers in. And then saw on off the top to the correct height, keeping it level, and it will look beautiful. Paint it, and it'll be a beautiful raised garden bed. There's going to be a wall coming across about halfway that way over there and then this side is going to be basically open. I'll probably have something that I can remove board wise on and off to get at the dirt um, as we go because all of that material is going to get pushed over into the bin and fill her up. Okay, before I do that, stage two is putting the wall that's going to go from there straight across to about where that um, um, thing is that you see sticking at the base. It's not the actual thing, it's on the outside over there just like this one's on the outside. And it's gonna have a, this front one's gonna have a four by four that's probably gonna be as big as I can get it. Um, Cause I'm gonna do some special things to the pole so that in Christmas time, I can attach tons of Christmas lights to it and it'll go up in a big semicircle up into the air and be a big Christmas tree and you'll be able to see it from a long way away. It'll be cool. So that's going to be that. Um, halfway across this garden bed because there's going to be a beam set to go all the way across because that's going to hold up the actual wall to the thing because we were just inside and outside for the uh, bed itself. The outside wall is going to have to float over the top of it. So I'm going to take right in the middle and put a beam that can take a beam from here to the middle and from the middle to the other side and be solid, solid floating. Um, so there'll be a post about out there that holds the beam that comes across the middle. So I have to make a list of parts that I need, go to the store, get screws, wood, and start up stage, whatever. <laughs> I'm not naming my stages, but it's all right. Um, yeah, that's where I'm at. Gonna have some more fun. Gonna try and organize this wood. Get the really good boards from the ones that are crooked up a bit. So I have a stack of each instead of just having one big pile I have to search for with nails sticking up. But yeah, I'll piddle around with that. Got to finish those. My son-in-law, well, my to-be son-in-law from my younger daughter is going to bring me, I believe he said, 20 some more pallets. So I'm going to be moving the whole pallet operation away from the front of the garage probably over here at the end of the bed and I can put the good wood close to here in a stack the wood that's not good there and we'll get all that done there's my daughter do something silly what? do something silly what? do something silly no, what are you doing? Um, nothing really I was making a video <laughs> no, nope. coming after you now. Where are you going? Where are you going?